In today's video, I'll be showing you how to clear WhatsApp cache on your iPhone. Now, if the WhatsApp application accumulates too much cache data, then it's going to affect the app. It's, uh, for one, going to occupy too much space, and also it's going to occupy uh, too much RAM, which basically means it's going to become laggy and slow. So to clear WhatsApp cache on your iPhone, go to settings, under settings, scroll down and tap on general. And under general, tap on iPhone storage. That's going to list for you all the apps on your iPhone. So find WhatsApp, select it. And just like you would clear cache on any other app, go ahead and delete the WhatsApp application. Now, before you do this, make sure you've done a backup of WhatsApp so you don't lose any important data or media. Once you've done that, you can now just come here and tap on delete app. So basically we want to delete that application. And once it's deleted, you can now go to the Apple app store and reinstall the app. So just go to the app store, go to the search function, find WhatsApp. And then install the app and set it up afresh and make sure while you're setting up, you restore from the backup. So I'm just gonna show you how to do this. So we've installed the app, I'll tap on open, and let me set this up. So agree and continue, put in your phone number, and then tap on next. And as you can see, my iPhone can already detect that I have a backup, okay? so. Make sure you don't skip this step. Just go ahead and tap on restore. That's going to restore your WhatsApp application. It's going to restore your charts, your media, everything. Now, depending on how much storage space WhatsApp was occupying or how much or, or the size of your data, it's going to take some time. Now, mine is just 10.66 gigs. So I'll have to be patient and wait. Currently, the messages have been restored. If I tap on next, it's going to say what's up, like what would like to access my contacts. I can just hit continue. I'm going to allow full access. Now this, this is personal. You can choose whatever you want at this point. And then put in your name and tap on done. Okay, so now as you can see, WhatsApp is now uh, setting back up. Now the charts have already been restored because charts are light, but the media is going to take some time. So as you can see, currently the media is still being restored, but now more importantly, the cache data has been deleted. Now, keep in mind that this is only going to clear cache data. If you wanted to free up storage space occupied by WhatsApp on your iPhone, then you need to watch other videos. For instance, I have a video on how to delete media. And also I have another video on how to clear WhatsApp storage space on your iPhone. So I'll link those down below because that is something different. And if you want to, you can check those out and that's it. Thanks for watching. Comments and questions down below and good luck.